I said, kneel and drink. Now! Okay, this is weird. This is very weird. Okay, this is very weird. I did not expect this to happen. This is not what I expected at all. I'm, I'm, okay, this is worse than... Yo, YouTube, it's your boy DJ, and welcome back to Vampire. This is whatever part this is. I don't remember exactly what part we're on. Before we start this video, I want to say, of course, make sure to leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you already haven't. Make sure to video as much as possible because it helps my content, helps my content, helps my channel out as much as, um, helps my channel out a lot. My thumb kind of hurts. I don't know why my thumb kind of hurts. Um, it shouldn't affect my gameplay at all. I don't think it should, so we'll be fine. Anyway, let's hop back into it. Um, so how do we get here? Do we just walk? Through here? I assume we can. Who are you? Are you alright, sir? What are you doing here? I could ask you the same question. Don't you know this is a quarantine zone? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm investigating the epidemic. You had better get to a safe place while you still can. Oh, really? Well, go investigate somewhere else. And leave me be. I beg your pardon. I said go. Leave me alone, sir. Okay, we will not talk to you then. What's up with them? Are those flies? What is that? Oh. Let me get out of here. Yeah, it has to be this way, right? Yep. I cannot enter. So I don't know if you have to do it all at one time or if I can come back and do the objective, but I think I'm going to do it off camera. I'm, I don't think it's that important. If it is important, I'll record it off camera. I'll record it, but if not, then I'll just leave it alone. Anyway, how y'all day going? How was y'all day going, now? How was your week? How was your month so far? If y'all got anything planned for December, for Christmas, or anything, let me know down in the comments below. I will gladly read it, you know? What was that sound? I don't know if y'all heard that, but what? just leave it alone. Leave it alone. Wazzy? Welcome back, Dr. Reed. Would you like to take communion with me now? Sean, are you eating raw flesh? It is the sacred flesh of the mortal lamb. Our Lord's bountiful transmutation for the sustenance of his believers. Thank you, Lord. I am your most humble servant. So, true to your word, you waited for my return. I told you, Dr. Reed. I was a man to be trusted. Did you have words with the poor Harriet? This shelter is the tip of the iceberg. You hide your game well, I'll give you that. We are God's children, Dr. Reed. One and all. And he's determined to save us. Oh. 
What will be the result if you continue to assist both Skulls and the living? For the last decade, that's what's been happening. And they found a better life. What's to change? You're forgetting the epidemic. Things can go south very quickly. I've seen it. Oh, these are terrible times. Only those pure of heart shall prevail. You've turned Skull now. Don't you see the danger to anyone giving you their trust? We are all sinners, awaiting salvation. This is a simple truth, ordained by the Lord Almighty. I am a seeker of his glorious light. Does this place belong to you? How can you be so certain you can keep it open? This warehouse was once property of the Dawson family, but has been bequeathed me through donation. The Dawsons? The wealthiest family in London? Have they a clue as to what goes on here? Not at all. The donation was made before the war. The building was run down. I never met Aloysius Dawson myself. So you have the run of the place and no one's taken notice? As long as we keep to ourselves, we interest no one. This is a haven, and I pray it remains so for eons to come. Harriet, Miss Jones has been behaving in a most violent manner. She's going to need special attention. That's precisely the reason I brought her here. To meet old Bridget. She's the guide Harriet requires. Who is this old Bridget? I don't know, Doctor. She rarely speaks of her past, but I know she has a long one. She's likely the oldest soul in the city. Harriet is possessed by her hatred. You cannot let her roam free. She's dangerous. She has joined her own client, Doctor. Old Bridget is a saint to the younger Skulls, guiding them to salvation and peaceful existence. I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm certain you've killed no one, but one day I believe you'll cross the line. <sighs> Logic is a false prophet. Faith is the only path to salvation. What do you mean? We have been blessed with God's eternity. We are the instruments of his divine will. We shall feed the hungry forever and ever. Amen. Okay. I've already seen that. Why is it showing details for that? I haven't the luxury of being able to satisfy my hunger on staunch blood and lifeless flesh. Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Expel your urges and kneel before the Lord in praise. These urges... You know the hunger will never be satisfied. I've come to embrace the everlasting craving. I have sworn to feed only upon the flesh of the dead. It is now my sacrament. Take, eat. This is my body. So saith the Lord. Whoa, I envy the pe I envy the peace you found. You sacrifice 500 M XP in the process. You will heal through my blood. I don't trust you. You sacrifice 500 XP in the process. Whoa, turn. Oh my god. I. You sacrifice 500 XP is not a lot of XP, so I'm not even worried about that. That's what I'm worried about. Turn? Oh my god. If I embrace him, everybody's gonna know that he's gone. If I spare him, then this is all for nothing. You 
know it. My discoveries. Vampire blood would enhance your metabolism, perhaps even heal you. If what old Bridget says is true, I'll give you some of mine. I, I'd rather not. It would be extremely awkward. You have no choice, Sean. It's the only way to protect your chapel, those still amongst the living. No, Dr. Reed. God made me this way. Who am I to disobey his will? You believe that God's plan was for you to be abandoned at birth? <sighs> the Lord works in mysterious ways. I can't imagine God intended for you to be molested by a priest in an orphanage. Drink, friend. No. I said, kneel and drink. Now. Okay, this is weird. This is very weird. Okay, this is very weird. I did not expect this to happen. This is not what I expected at all. I'm, I'm, okay, this is worse than... Get me out of here, bro. Get, get me out of here, bro. Oh my, get me out of here, bro. What in the world is going on? Another corpse thrown in the streets. Someone's playing a very sick game. Good evening, Mr. Throgmorton. Dr. Reed, can I be of any assistance? Have you noticed anything <coughs> suspicious lately? So, how exactly are you protecting these people? I'm curious. I patrol late at night, investigating anything unusual. Have we talked to about this? I try this? and encourage people to stay indoors, but people are careless. Can I help in any way? Actually, yes. I plan to put up posters to alert the population to the vampire threat. Are you asking me to paste posters about vampires around the docks? If you wouldn't mind. I don't know. If you did that, then I can focus on my patrol. It wouldn't be a bad idea. That's not a terrible idea. How do you identify a vampire? It's simple, really. They can't stand daylight. They're afraid of garlic and holy symbols. And they also cannot enter a house without being invited. Have you ever killed one of these creatures? Yourself, I mean. Of course I have. What kind of question is that? It's a dirty business, believe me. No, he hasn't. Big cap. What can you tell me about this neighborhood? Did you hear about what happened to Jack Gillingham? Poor oh boy. It's a shame I wasn't around to protect him. It's impossible to protect everyone. The violence seems endemic in this part of town. But it's my duty. I am convinced Jack Gillingham was killed by a vampire. These evil rodents are spreading like a plague. Have you heard of the Guard of Prewen? Of course. They're dedicated hunters. A little militant for my taste, but they do let anyone join. <laughs> I mean, I must say, do you want to join? Were you ever tempted to join the Guard yourself? I did think about it, but I'm more of a silent hunter. They're more of a sanitary militia. So you hunt alone? That sounds risky. Vampires are just like every other predator. They hunt when they're hungry and follow certain patterns. It's just a matter of observation and patience. Did you see what happened to him? Actually, yes. He was thrown from the roof like a vulgar log. Who could have done that? Who? Well, a vampire, of course. Look. Bite marks on the neck and lacerations here. There is definitely a vampire close by. Why is it that you sound so afraid? You didn't see it. 
He was dead before he hit the ground. Dang. The strength required to do such a thing will. It beggars belief. That boy got his neck Goodbye. Bit. <coughs> And good hunting, Mr. Throckmorton. So most likely it was another vampire. Probably not a vampire we're gonna meet. Or it might be somebody we already know. Most likely it's a vampire we're gonna meet. Glad to see you again. That's not what I want to talk to. Did you see what no. you saw nothing at all? No. I told you, just that awful woman scream. A woman scream? Are you sure? Of course. It was terrifying. I thought it was my sister, so I ran. But it was a man I've never seen round here before. Tell me a man sound like a woman screaming, but Goodbye, he's. Miss Paxton. He said he, he said he was dead before he hit the ground. How does that add up? That doesn't add up at all. You again? What do you want? Did you see what just happened? No, I didn't, and I don't care. Really? Wow. Why is that? Because this sexist pig is one of the four men who blacklisted me. Good riddance, if you ask me. Well, I'll leave you. Okay, Miss Paxton. I'm sorry. Dang. You give me a thumbnail. Though. I'm not gonna lie. I'm joking. I, I know I'm this. I'm just trying to get a, get a thumbnail. This is my mother's. A birthday gift from father. Twenty nine Pretty Orchard Street. That's near Poplar's district. Was a wallet? Oh, yeah. Right. A cheap leather wallet found on the corpse of a uh, Yeah, twenty nine Pretty Awkward Street. O Orchid Street. Why would this man carry off my mother's brooch? I must go there. Yeah, you the thumbnail, buddy. That's a good thumbnail right there. That's good. Alright, let's go. <clears throat> Can we go this way? Is there anything here I should grab before I leave, though? It's locked. There we go. See me. Hey, don't worry about me, bro. I'm not touching you. Um, should I go this way? Or should I go that way? I don't know which way. There's level 20 scale. I don't want to face anybody who's mad higher level than me right now because I don't want to get beasted. So. <laughs> I'm gonna try and avoid. I'm just gonna walk past. Don't worry about me, bro. The safer place is to be than here. I'm gonna leave him. No I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. I'm gonna leave. How am I supposed to? Oh no, man! <clears throat> I have to go past him, don't I? Let me see something. Wait, don't I? I have to go through them. Is there another way? Why can't I just like teleport through this hole or something? Oh my god, I have to go through them. Oh Jesus. That's both they're both level twenty. He's big as heck too. He level twenty one. You know what? Come on.
Let me just get rid of him first. And then... Come on, just hit. Oh my god, just hit him. Kill him. Bro. Okay, 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 okay. So I. This is why I don't want to face level 20, bro, because this is the BS you have to go through. Oh my god. And there's no other way to go, is there? Because honestly, I want to go to a bed and evolve just so I can come back a little bit stronger. Because this is kind of. This is mad BS. Is that a hideout right there? Oh my god. Good looks. We gotta try out that gun eventually. I wanna try both of my guns eventually. Well, um, nothing is happening right now, right? Nothing significant is happening right now, right? Pretty sure there's no objectives that I can't just do another night. Nah, nothing significant. Let's just upgrade. Alright, what should I upgrade now? Um. Well, first of all, my health is definitely needs to upgrade. My stamina definitely needs to upgrade as well. So let's do that. There we go. Use my stamina. All right. Increase damage inflicted when biting in combat. Increase your blood capacity. Oh, my blood capacity needs to upgrade as well. Your blood absorption when in combat. We're gonna focus on the bite and um, <clears throat> yeah, we we'll focus on our bite and blood absorption and stuff like that. So let's increase the bites. There we go. And I think that's yeah, all we can do. Okay, so how much did we upgrade then? You must know who Sean Hampton. Oh, that's like Patrick Hampton is. Was that Patrick? Wow. Alright, um... Okay. I only went up one level off the that much XP? That was like 2,000 XP! Oh my god, I'm getting finessed. So I gotta fight with what I have, bro. Well, this is really sad. I gotta increase my blood capacity a lot more. Alright, let's equip a revolver. Oh, it's a um, stun weapon. Or a secondary weapon, I guess. Yep, equip this. Can I unequip it? I can't unequip it. I have to equip something else. Um, What's the next best thing I have? 65 damage, 65, 72. It's most likely the Yasuo Axe. I guess we'll equip um, this one then. Use the revolver. Oh, you can switch your. So, what's the. Point. I can switch my. I guess if I want some faster melee attacks, I'll get to use that. But <clears throat> besides that, I don't really want that. 
All right, trial number three. It's like third time's charm, so let's do this. This is no place for you, sir. Oh, I used the gun first. Oh, crap, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> um. I'm not used to doing that. I'm used to switching my entire load of SOS block. You gotta be careful. Come on, bro. Yo. All right, switch it out. Want some of this? Oh, so glad to be done with that. Thank goodness. All right, so the revolver seems pretty weak. I definitely should upgrade that. But it's very good for long range if I need some range, and it'll definitely get me. It, it's pretty good. It's not that bad. It's going to require a lot of ammo, though. Luckily, we can, um, you can replenish your ammo at hideouts no matter. I guess um, no matter how many times you use it, you can always replenish your ammo. There's some more guys up here. He's level 22. It's only these guys? I can handle this. Best be moving on. Yeah, I can handle this. Did you hear me? Get our weapons ready! We found All right, I'm gonna definitely keep running this loadout <clears throat> until I have to fight a boss or something. I might have to switch it out. Twenty nine Pretty Orchard Street. This is it. What's in there for me? There's been a fight here. The fact that I can still see myself in a mirror is, um, I've already said it's not accurate. For our country, for our, for... The game's kind of bugging because, um, Things are happening like after, like a, a millisecond after I've already done it. That's fine, though. It's fine. This window was shattered with violent force. Someone's been pulled through it and dragged through the street. No, looks like have done that? I thought somebody had been thrown. Does but to say. <laughs> I'm just waiting for a jump scare. Oh, Jesus Christ. Where does this blood trail lead? I'm just waiting for like a boss fight or something. Just something crazy to happen. 
This can't just be a regular walk. It's locked, all right. No, we still can't go through there. Oh, Are you dead? Oh no, he's just gonna sit there. Okay, he's gonna post it up. All right, let me post up on you then. Still hit me, okay. <sighs> Why? You're surprising. Why, man? Bro, and I have to fight him, bro. Alright, well, you know what? Hold up. There's one thing. We might as well change it up right now. Because he's not going to be a long-range fighter, so... Let's use this. Just try and sneak up on him. Nice. Shut up. Okay, okay, now you're just being annoying. Oh my god. We can't be defeated. Can I what? The fact that he still had block after that is the most BS I've ever seen. Why am I locked directly onto you? Yo, back up, bro. Three, two, one. Oh, you just... Well, I'm not gonna question it. You turned around so slowly. What was that? Okay, this is weird. Hold up. Yeah, just die. I don't even care. The marks on this woman's neck were made by the fangs of a vampire. This is the very flower my mother tossed on Mary's coffin. Someone is targeting my family. Her shoes and clothes are quite worn out. Bro, who is this? Only a golden watch in her pockets. We'll take the watch. Right then, it's a sick game, but given no choice in the matter, I might as well win it.
I'm gonna say, isn't the hideout? <sighs> oh my god. I've been recording for 41 minutes. Oh my Jesus. I need to stop. Okay. I did not know I was recording for this long. Um, we're gonna end it here. This is a good spot anyway. So, um, I pause it. Get out. Pause it. Alright. I did not know I was recording for this long. I was enjoying it way too much. So, um, hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. Make sure to friends. Make sure to try and post screens when I post a video. And make sure to leave a comment, um, about, what was about, what was the thing I wanted to comment? Oh, if you're doing anything for Christmas, let me know. And, yeah, um, make sure to click on the video right above my head. Or, click on the playlist to the side. Check any video out that you missed. And, yeah, see you guys in the next video. Today's your birthday. Happy birthday. Till next time, of course. Peace. Banger. I didn't know I was scoring for this long. Jesus.